All right, so now we're um, nearing the diner. I'm going to go ahead and get out. Uh, I think I can get into uh, either one of these places, but yeah. I'm just going to um, kill this guy. Oh, okay, just exploded, that's fine. Uh, <laughs> Alright, so yeah, what you can do is, um, I'm not sure which what I'm going to do first either. Yeah, I'll, I'll go in this one first, even though this has got the random weapon box. I've got a B23R, so it'll be fine. I'm going to add the part here so that I can get up. And um, yeah, over there is Galva Knuckles, as you hopefully saw there. But yeah, I, d I don't have the money for that yet, so um, yeah. I don't know if that's... Yep, that's a kill. That's good. Ow. Bastards. <laughs> a full mag to the head is um, a kill with this thing, so... Well, DM 1911. Uh, da -da. Yeah, I um, I'm not sure if I said about anything about this, but yeah, this is original difficulty, so yeah, it's not as if it's on um easy or anything. So this is like the um strategy for the legitimate strategy for the difficulty it's on. Whoop! No, oh, I saw someone. I saw one of the zombies drop something. Okay. Oh, is that two things? Yeah. Okay. There you go. Okay. Yeah, that's uh, the fucking Avogadro. He is annoying as hell. Let's keep running around. Knife him whenever you can. Um. Whoop. Because you don't want him uh, hitting you, because... But I thought that should have killed him. Apparently not. Just uh, evasive maneuvers. Nah, fuck that. Okay, yeah. I no longer have. Um... Okay, yeah. Uh, hopefully that killed him. That sounded like a bit of a. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so I killed the Avogadro. That's good. Thank goodness for that. Um, yeah, the boss is going to go soon. But yeah, so basically you're going to be wanting to uh, run around in um, this area for the main um, part of your um, survival in here. Careful of the boss. Um, oh, double points. That's useful. Okay, <laughs> they all just got um, ran over. Um, no, you get back down there, you bastard. Okay. Double points. Oh, yay, five bullets. One, two, three, four, five. That was incredible. Okay. Never again. Okay. Yeah, this thing is quite powerful if you do burst to the head. Oh, yeah, 800 points. That's what I like. All right. So, yeah, now I'm going to get the uh, Galva Knuckles, which in general are quite a viable strategy. Um, I would say first of all that they're good for the um, Avogadro, but I already beat him, so um, I'm not sure if he comes back at all, but um, yeah. Another thing, MP5, you can restock ammo every now and then. Oh, speaking of ammo. Da -da. So that's good. Um, yeah, so there we go. I don't know why I shot it, and I could just bloop, um, have this out for... Fast galvanuckling. Is that a word? Galvanuckling? Of course, don't forget, always shoot if you don't think you, um, if you think you might be in too much danger from just, um, knuckling him. Of course, you don't really want to take on, um, any more. In fact, you should probably be, um, quite concerned even with taking on, uh, three zombies that are very close together. Ow. Bastards. Um, but yeah, in general, um, if it's four zombies very close to each other, you do not want to go, um, right up to them. So, yeah. 
stay away from that. I'm sure there's another one there. He's the last one. Yeah, he's the last one now. Da -da -da. Oh yeah, these things that destroy your perks. Um, oh, I'm going to see if I can. Whoop. Oh fuck! Yeah, turns to differ. Um, see if I can get speed cola very quickly. Um, let's start this round. Uh, why is he so far? Off? Okay, there we go. Whoop. Buh! Buh! Uh, buh! Okay, there we go. <laughs> Got speed cola. Buh! I'm not sure if that actually, no, it doesn't speed that up. For a second there, that um, particular knuckle looked faster, but I guess it wasn't. <laughs> but yeah, as you may be able to tell, Galva knuckling or as um, Bowie Knifing was like, you could actually get the uh, Bowie Knife instead of uh, Galva Knuckles if you wanted to. It's in um, some cabin in the uh, woods around somewhere. I'm not actually sure if it is woods, but you know, there are. Yeah, I'm not sure if um, the Avogadro comes back. I don't actually remember, but yeah. This is my. Um, viable strategy so far. Um, so yeah, you want to um, keep hitting the uh, random box basically until um, you find uh, a good weapon like a... Um, generally you want to keep your MP5 but yeah, keep going for the um, better weapons, get all the stuff if you run out of ammo then keep buying it from the wall and stuff like that, you can pack a punch if you want, but in general, if you know what you're doing, this is the, oh wow, <laughs> but in general, this can, um, just running around here, that can, this can get you to pretty much whatever level, so, um, yeah, as long as you're, um, good enough at, um, running around also, uh, what you could do is, um, there's also a um, good spot in the town, although that is kind of dangerous because of the higher amounts of um, little lava cracks that will screw you over. But um, yeah, that's just generally because um, I originally didn't think that um, it would be so good, but um, it is actually quite an open space in town, so um, yeah. I noticed it while playing um, survival on the uh, survival map town but yeah that um, ought to be um, that is also a um, good place to run around in um, town just outside uh, the um, bank building I'm not sure if that will be worth it at all might as well it's just for the hell of it mm. da -da -da. Uh, type 25. Uh, the box. Stupid. <laughs> um, but yeah. Oh, yay, Teddy. So, yeah, I might be able to show you that, but, um, essentially, this is where all you really need for the, um, strategy of it. That's where it, um, this is where it ends, but uh, if you want to carry on watching just for, um, enjoyment or, um, little tips and tricks along the way, then, uh, please do, because there will be um, other episodes along. Of course, um, oh god, what the fuck is that guy doing? <laughs> He's um, on the bus, that ought to be him dead. No. Yeah, so yeah, that's an that's a, um, example of how um, effective Galva Knuckles are on um, the Avogadro. But yeah, essentially, um, you want to be running around in here. Not in here, um, out there. But yeah, basically, um, there's also, um, I think it's called Die Rise, the, um, what's it, the new map that's going to be coming soon. I'm probably going to be doing a um, strategy guide as that, but um, of course I'm also going to be doing a uh, first attempt live commentary that's going to be um, hopefully up on the day um, of release, which would be good. But yeah. So, um, if you want to watch that, then please do. 
But for now, that's the end of the strategy. Um, I'm not sure if this is going to be the like the end of an episode or anything. So <laughs> I don't know what um, length it's actually um, going to be at the moment. So um, yeah, I can't particularly decide on what to do. You could also uh, potentially run around in here. I'm just going to do that so I can better survive. But um, yeah, I'm not sure if I've got anything in the um, in here. Ah, uh, oh well. That only had a uh, that had very little ammo, so um, I might as well have stored that. Oh, what's up, guys? Uh, but yeah, we go ahead and uh, start running around over here. This is a um, quite a viable place to run around as well. Um, even though I've just got pushed back here, but you can always just lead them around and go straight back up. Of course, unless there are uh, any in your way. Oh, insta kill. Uh, da -da -da, that's all of them dead. And it's max ammo. How useful. Um, yeah, I have uh, nothing. <laughs> oh, well, um, I can't be bothered to get that just in case it's uh, leaving. Well, there's a dig. What is a dig? Um, boop. That wasn't a clap. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay, there we go. I could do with getting a, a ray gun or something, but yeah. Um, for now, I'm going to go to uh, the town and see if I can uh, start running around in there. I don't know why I'm using my um, MP5 so much. I could easily um, conserve ammo and just use my um, Galvan knuckles. But yeah, the Avogadro does come back, which is kind of unfortunate. But um, yeah, you can kill him fairly easily with Galvan knuckles, so it's not really a. Um, too bad. That's uh, the importance of Gavel Knuckles. This don't makes it incredibly easy to um, kill not just zombies for points in uh, the rounds up to round 14, but it also makes it very easy to kill the um, Avogadro when he does start messing with his shit. Oh, hi. You run bloody fast. Um, oh, what are these guys doing? Bastards. Get off the bus! You're not meant to be on here. Oh, oh bastard. He's going to come down here soon. Oh, here we are here, um, I don't actually want to be here, never mind, um, don't know if I can get Tombstone or anything, maybe. Yeah, hopefully they can't come back this way, I think they can actually, oh yeah, they can. Oh well, yeah, hi, 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 Whoop. hi. Yeah, um, hmm, oh. oh, hi, nice to see you, oh, Superman, um, yeah, there isn't Tombstone, because that doesn't, um, Tombstone is multiplayer thing, oh, okay, that was dangerous, uh, this is dangerous, very dangerous. Okay. Okay. <laughs> that was quick. He didn't stay on for long. Okay, can you please go soon, bus driver? Okay, <laughs> that seemed to work. Um. Yeah. So yeah, I'm somehow surviving in this. Oh, fucking hell. Die. But yeah, the main reason why it's uh, better to run around in the um, diner area is because of the, um, what's it, MP5 that you can keep restocking. No, I reckon just for the purpose of ammo conservation, I'm going to get a B23 again. Plus I can um, galvanuckle with it faster. <laughs> Oh, bastard. No, Good thing this is a one-shot for now, because it makes it really easy to defend the bus. 